Hello friends, this is Imran. In today's lesson, we are going to learn that how we can check any 3D model in a section view. Or like let's say if I want to check the what is inside this uh, 3D model. So for that, if you uh, check here on the right side, there is that option that is a multiple section click on it then you will see like there are like three uh, main directions x y and z coordinates let's say i want to check into the x value and i want to see what is inside so this red line is actually uh, showing us the plane from it is like from where i can cut and i can check like what is inside this object and i can also change the change the position of this cut i can either indicate the position I can also like move it like this okay and uh, let's say right now I cannot see what is inside it is because in the clip mode it is uh, selected as just a line so what I need to do I need to click on it once and then you can see it has cut it from the left side where when I click one more time it will be cut it on the right side and then we can see what is inside we can also move this line and then we can uh, check our 3d model and we can do the inspection of it so the same thing if if i uncheck it i i go to the z direction i move it i'm just changing the clip setting so i can check in any direction i can check in z direction as well indicate it and then indication and then I can change the clip setting from top and then you can see uh, we, can, we can inspect the model in various ways one more important part sometimes it happens that uh, we lost this icon from here so there is a way to bring back that option is that uh, go to the option help and from there click on the customize UI once you click on it, click on the toolbar and here if you check right bar tools that, that is the right toolbar that is this section overall and here you can see the first option is multiple section. Right now if I uncheck it, it will disappear. If I click it again, it will appear. So this is how we can uh, bring back this icon from the ui command or like this uh, customized ui settings so this is the end of this lesson let's move, move forward to the other one thank you if you have any kind of comments you can ask me uh, in the comment section